Hello, hello, I am the Malwest Cowboy, back again with Ark Survival Evolved on the Scorched Earth map. Um, I've spent a couple of days just uh, gathering resources, so I thought today I'd do something a bit different. Um, and what I decided to do was, I, I, I'm unhappy with the idea of um, a, a T-Rex so close to my base. Um, not Tina, she, she's fine obviously, um, she's tamed, but there was the other one which I think was a level 4. So what I've decided to do is um, bring Tina down and eliminate the problem. I, I did take Tina out uh, to go hunting and try and gain some levels on her, so um, I'm hoping that uh, she's more than capable of dealing with the level 4 T-Rex. Um, wild t uh, wild um, dinosaurs on this game tend to be a bit tougher um, compared with an equal level tamed dinosaur. Um, so if you had two level 4 dinosaur, uh, level 4 T-Rexes and one of them was wild and the other one wasn't, uh, the one um, that was wild would have slightly better hit points or melee or something compared with the um, the tamed one, which is unfortunate. Um, but yeah, uh, I can't actually see the T Rex around. He was over in this corner. Um, I don't know whether he went down the valley or he went up over there I'm not sure I probably should have scouted out um, where he was before um, bringing the, the, my T-Rex out here but um, yeah that's a bit of a ooh, that's a bit of a disappointment because I've just spotted something intriguing, look, intriguing looking I've got to go and explore that. Come on, this way, T Tina. I should be able to get up there. Um, the, the reason I brought the RG was because I wanted um, the T Rex to be fighting the T Rex, um, but just on, on the off chance that the, um, my T Rex wasn't as tough as I thought it was. Um, I brought the RG just to assist. There you go. And I don't know if she got any levels out of that. I'll just yes, she did. Um, I did put some into the health because the health was quite low for a T Rex. It, I think it was about two and a half thousand when I initially tamed her. Um, which yeah, for a T Rex getting into battles against really big, scary things, um, that wouldn't have been enough. But yeah, uh, she's got plenty of meat on her to um, to uh, heal up. I, I can force feed her if necessary. So yeah, we'll just proceed over to this intriguing little house thing. Ah, oh, terror birds up there. A couple of them. Stupid enough to yes, one it is. And now the other one's coming. <laughs> it, they're not quick learners. They saw what happened to his friend and then decided to run down and take take on a T Rex.
Um, I didn't even see. Oh. I was just going to say, I didn't see notification that the T Rex had killed it. Which is a little odd. I wonder if there's a survivor note box. There is. Explore notes. That's what they're called. I, for some reason, I keep calling it um, survivor notes. Okay. And so, yeah, we got um, the XP boost timer going. Hopefully that applies to the RG I'm on as well as myself. Oh, seems it's not fast enough. She must be too full of meat. Actually, it's too fast for my RG. That's pretty poor if a Morellatops can outrun an Argentavis. I'm just going to um, refill my water. And while I'm here, I'll um, make sure my shotgun is out and equipped. I see a raptor, which is one of the reasons I got my weapon out. Oh, uh, I've got no... Um, no torch um, at all. Okay, I'm going to have to make one. Do I have the ingredients on me? No, I'm going to need wood. Um, hmm. Darkness falls, and I I can't see anything. As usual, um, if anything happens while I'm waiting for dawn, I'll um, show it to you, but if not, I'll see you when the day breaks. As, as you can see, it's daylight. We survived the night. A um, couple of raptors attacked in the darkness, but um, I didn't bother showing it because I couldn't even see it myself. Um, so... Yeah, um, I didn't notice in that um, drop I collected, uh, there was actually a stone, uh, uh, a water jar in there. Now, water jars are really helpful because um, they don't seep. I know I mentioned this in an um, earlier video before I lost the water jars I had, but um, yeah, it's good to have one now. Um, Oh, Mantis. I haven't seen those over this area. Is Tina following? I don't think she can. I think she's too full of food. Just um, quickly sort that out, because that, that won't do. Uh, it seems a shame to dump all this meat out on the ground, but um, she harvests so much um, with each kill. With, um, yeah, she, she quickly fills up on meat. More meat than um, she requires. I'll just um, quickly. 
Ooh, organic polymer. Maybe I can use that for... Um, I sounded like a Gallimimus. Yeah. Uh, maybe I could use that instead of regular polymer to make... Um, oh, it's on a spoil timer. Um, to make my GPS and anything polymer-ish. Um, I know polymer-ish isn't a real word. Um, I'm sorry for my linguistic slackness. Um, it's not a usual trait of mine. <coughs> uh, but yeah, I've got the polymer in the, the um, T-Rex now because I don't want it to spoil. It's on a spoil timer. Um, I'm glad now I found a source of. Oh, there's a sheep. Sheep. Um, I'm glad I've got a source of polymer other than having to go out to the mountains now. Oh, there's a couple of horrible pigs over here. I mean, they, they shouldn't. No, there's three of them, but yeah, there shouldn't be much difficulty for the T-Rex. I've got two of the three. There's a lot of predators around here. Uh, right, let's try and find that um, little building I saw in the distance. If I can. Oh, there's a drop over there. Oh. Come on, Tina, do your stuff. He's going to have a go at the T-Rex. Oh, rg has got a level. That's cool. Um, I'll just... I'm not sure what to put that in. Um, stamina, probably. <laughs> Although, hit points are pretty low. I just wish I could do something about the movement speed. Um, even empty, the movement speed on these things is pretty woeful. I'll just drop this out of my inventory. I don't need it. See, that's weighs 45. Um, Uh, yeah, there's Bronto Saddle in here that weighs 20. Um, it's the one I mentioned in yesterday's video. So, um, yeah, it's water well in there. Uh, I'll just quickly think that. Right, um, should. Oh, I just better check Tina's weight. Oh, she's got a level as well. There we go. And. No, wrong way. Tina, wrong way, you contrary creature. There's an RG up there. Not sure what level. No vultures. Now, can I get in this one? Yes, I can. Uh, anything good? Fiomia saddle? Blueprint for Fiomia saddle? The rest of it's rubbish. Um, let's 
get some altitude and see if I can see that building. Tina ended that fight even though there wasn't anything to do with her. Uh, I'm disorientated. I can't remember where that um, little hut with, or um, structure with the dome roof is. Luckily, um, Tina makes so much noise when she's walking, I, I don't need to check whether she's behind me. Megatherium. That'll probably give good levels. There we go. Um, right, I'll just land here. Oh. The vulture's been there, uh, went and damaged my armour. I think I might just uh, get Tina to stop here a moment. Um, no, stop here a moment. Uh, while I go and ha have a quick scout around for this strange building, get some altitude to see what that does. Let's see. I'll try over this direction a little bit. Get it up above these trees. Was it just a mirage? Is that a thing in the game? You know, phantom buildings off in the distance. Ah, Kentrosaurus. These are sort of like, um, well, they're, they're quite like Stegosaurus, but um, they, they work as a team, and it can be quite aggressive. That's really strange. Where I did definitely see a structure in through my um, telescope, but now I can't find the structure anywhere. Situations like this, um, I wish Mrs. Malibus Cowboy was here to say, no, you're going in the wrong direction, because she's very, very good at um, that sort of thing. Directions, uh, my sense of direction is quite poor, especially in ARC, um, which can lead to some problems. Uh, um, but, yeah, um, when I'm doing the live streams, um, <laughs> Sometimes she's there in the chat saying, no, no, you, you're supposed to go the other way. And, yeah, nine times out of ten, um, well, 95 times out of 100, she's right.
It's not over here. Oh, it's uh, the scorpion. Oh, uh, RG one one hit it, and then Tina ate that the corpse and the scorpion in the same bite. Ah, that's a nice colour scorpion. Well, it was. Um, yeah, I can't find that little building. I mean, I'll I'll find it one day. I'll I'll stumble across it, but um, yeah, that day's not today. It seems. And he's got quite a long way to go back um, because I have to keep relatively slow for the um, T Rex. So, I mean, she's tough, but she's not fast. And she hasn't got much stamina. But yeah, I think that's. Um, Quite a excursion for the day. I mean, well, I didn't manage. I didn't see that uh, other T Rex at all, so I'm not sure what the situation is there. That's weird. Um, can't see it. Get involved. Right, um, yeah, I shall return to the um, camp and um, I shall see you back there, I think. seeing what I'm seeing in the distance.
when the T-Rex's head gets out of the way. Uh, looks like another T-Rex. Uh, I finally found a T-Rex. I'm not sure if it's uh, the one. Oh, can't see it now. We'll get out of the way. Uh, see how Tina does. Hopefully, she doesn't. Wow, that's a level 32 and Tina totaled it. That was really cool. Um, so, <laughs> sorry, I'm a little surprised that um, she managed to do that. Uh, so, yeah, I'm going to have to drop a load of weight. Um, that organic polymer um, is fresh stuff. The uh, other organic polymer, um, I think, is nearly spoiled, completely spoiled. Because at least now I know that um, I can harvest organic polymer um, from somewhere other than, or I can get polymer from somewhere other than um, obsidian. Out of the way of the cacti. So yes, um. I, it's going to take quite a while to get back, and I hope I do so before um, the polymer, the fresh polymer I got, has um, run out. But yeah, um, I am a West Cowboy. Thanks for watching, and until next time, happy trails.